Hello everyone, this is J-Kid introducing uh, J-Kid's uh, anime commentaries, they're fan commentaries, so they're not really official. It's a part program, because I gotta really try and find something for me to do. Uh, this episode, we're gonna be uh, watching Drum and Gad, the first episode known as Gunmetal uh, Calico Road. Now, I actually seen this anime before at Anime USA 2012, and I actually was attracted to this anime by the name only. But the instant I saw it, I immediately felt this, uh, what you say, uh, uh, this Black Lagoon vibe to it. So let's just play it. Now, believe it or not, the poem is actually based, is actually where it actually came from, Norse mythology. Uh, look it up on Wikipedia. It's actually a poem, an actual poem from uh, Norse mythology. Now, in the, uh, in the fan subs, for some reason, they subtitled the the OP of this song, uh, Borderland, and with one and one of the last words they they misinterpreted as we are a killing team. But the reality is we are the real lyrics means we are the real lyrics means uh, reality and dream. Now, while this ad is going through, the uh, I want to talk about the anime for about s some seconds before the uh, before the ad ends. The uh, main relationship is uh, the main relationship. One of the main relationships is basically Coco and uh, Jonah, not related to Jonah the Ark, to join the main character of the Ark. He's actually a, a dark-skinned child. Oh, hey. Ad breaks over. This is how child soldiers are made.
Apparently he's very reluctant to do it. Coco, the local gun dealer. Now the uh, person to your person to your left, uh, Riley, in the Japanese uh, version, he had very deep voice, but in the American version, which is n not as good as the Japanese version, he has this natural African American voice and dialect. I mean, John is a child soldier, so he's already packing heat. I don't care about the money as well. Oh wait, I mean seriously, this isn't funny. I have a very terrible internet connection during the night. Again, I don't care about the money. Now, to allow I gotta allow this thing to uh, buffer a bit because for some reason I have a terrible internet connection. Anyway, Dorman again is basically Lord of the the Lord of War of uh, anime. Place the uh, male uh, place the uh, male uh, protagonist with a female one who is a bit on the local side, a bit of an insane side, with his uh, sidekick being. A tough as nails child. Yeah, it deals with very serious issues, primarily uh, arms traffic, tr arms trafficking, smuggling, uh, child's uh, children in warfare, uh, government corruption. But it tries not to take itself seriously because you can't take everything seriously. Now let's continue. We don't want your weapons, Gal. Do diligence, people. Introverts versus a bunch of extroverts.
Here comes the scouts. Mm. SOP SOP stands for Standard Operating Procedure. Now let me pause this thing for a bit. Anyway, you're gonna see, you're gonna hear a lot of military jargon and uh, acronyms in this anime. One of them is SOP, known as a standard operating procedure or standard operating protocol. It's usually used in the police, military. Another variant is known as uh, modus operandi or mode of operation. Now let's continue. No buffering. Oh wait, it continued. Now it's very clear for a very good reason we don't they don't want the we they don't want the weapons. They don't, they don't, they're fine with their position in the uh, Eastern uh, uh, European region, and they don't want these weapons shifting the balance. I mean, they got bigger problems to worry about, like the economy. Lose in the short term, and lose in the long term. Obviously not titanium. for all the wrong reasons. And with possibly accurate uh circuit uh, uh handwriting with a patch. Yeah, she actually said boo. And it's blatantly clear that the uh, the creators of the manga and anime know their weapons. At least Jonah remains human. Double kill. Game over indeed.
basically you've changed nothing and and John would have been dead. What is now what is Coco is trying to explain to Jonah are uh, weapons are a necessary evil. There are plenty of necessary evils in the world. Governments, states, prisons, laws. By arming both sides. Now, arming both sides of a conflict is actually a lot more profitable. And I want to say this while this ad is running. It's basically the equivalent of uh, mutual destruction, only, only difference is that you're not dealing with nuclear weapons, you're dealing with small arms. So, to both sides, and you make a lot of money from it. Now let me uh, pause. Now for some reason it's buffering again. So you can stop at what you're doing. Let me just pause it. And and just right now, uh, Jonah pointed his gun to his uh, crewmates as he still as he had to keep his guard up at all times, even while sleeping. So it's probably a force of habit for him. Bub boy needs his sleep. For fun and profit. Loco. As in loco. You can obviously see the eyes. Yeah, and it costs us your job. And it's amazing he still acts like a child. Another example of how Jordan tries not to take things seriously. Tries not to take things seriously. But 
it's obvious that Coco is smart, even though he she's loco. Now, the now it's obvious that this country is uh does speak Russian. The word "da" means yes. What the word yet yet means no. Yes, the Matrix. Now this spell is going to be very important in the uh, layer in the next scene. Good hunting. Now, HCLI stands for HNC Logistics uh, International. It's actually a uh, it's actually a transport company similar to uh, HDL Transport and Logistics, but it's actually a cover for uh, weapon smuggling. Oh, hey, here's another ad. I I mean weapon smuggling you know it's legal it's highly profitable many countries know this and they know weapon smuggling is a threat to national security as we saw in the last 20 minutes And this, uh, and this was clear uh, foreshadowing to to what's to come. In the end of this scene. <laughs> Problem is, the stunts will happen anyway. If Coco's team doesn't get to them first.
Your snipers are dead, mate. Bye bye. It's shut. They play a lot because they're playing off of blood vessels in the uh, forehead. Blood vessels and arteries in the forehead. That's why they play a lot. They're only human. Now you're going to hear this line traveling with the arms dealing. I, I travel with the arms dealer a lot. Now this last scene is going is a joke as well. And to but in sense that a family for some reason He's eating them without getting sick. That the real reason why they got sick while Jonah hasn't is a complete and utter mystery to me. Now the the ED song uh, is actually very uh calmly done done. It's actually in is in very strong contrast to the action pack OP song. It's actually a calming cooldown. And in the ED song in the anime, you're gonna see the image one the, one of the image that that image that you're gonna see on the that you'll see in the uh, bullet casing. It'll change every episode. But I'm not sure what I'm seeing if it's rain or film grain. And luckily this uh luckily I'm done with this uh this uh phase, this trial phase because this buffering is getting on my nerves. So I'm gonna stop the uh thing for now. To let it run. Now can I I wanna tell you straight up, I actually saw the original uh I actually saw the uh the original Japanese du Japanese version of uh Drummond Gand. But I'm not going to uh do any spoilers in in this uh dub in this uh commentary at all. Although the although I going although I going give you commentary based on what is going on here, I do have a knowledge of government and uh government and politics. So you're gonna hear me a lot about about government issues, related government slash politics issues and national security issues related to this uh, anime. I'm not saying that the anime is not a national security threat, but I'm just talking about national security issues that are depicted in this anime.
Mr. Holmes our secretary. You mean Ministry of Internal Interior Affairs? Because in most uh, East European countries, they have a Ministry of uh, Interior Affairs. Ministry of Interior Affairs are basically deal with uh, internal policing, uh, s domestic security intelligence, and uh, territorial guard, territorial defense in uh, serious cases of uh, terrorism. W Russia actually has them. Now, uh, Russia actually has them, uh, and most European countries have them as well. I don't remember seeing this uh, scene in black and white. Now the song, now the song you you just hearing right now, is basically what got the. Uh, now the song you just heard what. Now the song you just heard uh, right now, uh, believe it or not, was basically what should have been the true uh, ED. The true ending theme for our drone again, and that's how the uh, fandom got got this saying, got this uh, meme. Uh, Coco is loco. He might, she might be loco, but she's very smart. She might act like a child, but she's very smart. And that's it for our for our part uh, commentary. See y'all soon. I hope.